Now you have a new way inside the Jasper AI to generate an entire blog post in just a few clicks. And this new feature is called Workflows. And in this video, I will show you how you can use it and how it works. Welcome back on Digital Toolcase. In this video, I will talk about this new feature inside Jasper AI. And please remember, if you want, you can try Jasper AI for free. If you never did it, by clicking the link you find here below my video in the description you can use Jasper AI for free for five days and try with 10,000 words for free. It's very easy, just click on the link, you will reach this page and you can activate your free account. So you can try even this new feature that it's called Workflows. Now, when you create a new document inside the Jasper AI by clicking on Documents, you have this new workflow future and by clicking here on this menu uh, you can uh, generate a blog post workflow a social media campaign workflow a rewrite content workflow it's uh, just another way to create uh, content very quickly with jasper i wouldn't say an entire perfect article but uh, a draft to start your article anyway i click now on blog post workflow and this is my new screen with uh, a document on the right and this blog post workflow on the left. It's a guided way to generate an article very, very quickly in just a few clicks. And I suppose uh, you will have the chance in the future to uh, create your own customized workflows. Uh, at the moment, uh, you have three different workflows. This is for the blog post. So let's suppose I want to uh, write an article about uh, this topic. If you want to be a better person, do these seven things. I don't know if I will have uh, seven points uh, in uh, this first step. That's the blog post outline. Uh, let's uh, leave uh, witty as a tone of voice and let's click on generate. Okay, Jasper created this uh, outline for my blog post. Uh, point number one, be more forgiving. Point number two, be more helpful uh, so with a little bit of explanation. This can be a good outline. When you write an article, you need to do your research before writing with uh, Jasper AI or any other AI writing tool. Anyway, uh, you can generate your outline by hand or you can let the AI generate your outline. Let's uh, suppose we like this outline. As you can see, I have a six uh, uh, point and not seven. So let's change this title for the moment. And because I have six point, now Jasper generated six different paragraph generators here, 2.1, 2.2, and so on, until 2.6. And then I have a blog conclusion paragraph already filled with my outline. This is very useful to generate a blog post conclusion. So now I can just click on this next button and now I'm here. This way of generating an article with Jasper has some pros and some cons because you can guide your AI very quickly, but you have less control on uh, what you are writing uh, paragraph by paragraph. Anyway, you can then, when finished, make your edits uh, to the article and adjust it and complete it. Anyway, let's go on. As you can see, I can even include uh, a keyword if I want, uh, and this is very useful for SEO purpose. In this case, I will not insert any keyword and just click on generate. And we now have uh, the first paragraph. You can uh, stop the video if you want uh, and uh, read this paragraph. If you like it, you can click on the next button. If you don't like it, maybe it's not what you want, you can click on regenerate and you will have a new paragraph. I just click on next and now I'm here in this new paragraph. And as you can see, uh, my first paragraph is now copied, automatically copied here in the document. 
Now let's try in this paragraph just to show you how it works to include some kind of keyword, uh, something really simple. In this case, I didn't do any research, so helping uh, others. I just want this paragraph to be concentrated on this. It, it's obviously the topic of this uh, paragraph and I click on generate. This is my paragraph uh, and uh, I can't see in the paragraph the exact keyword. Uh, I have uh, helping people instead of helping others. Anyway, the meaning uh, is uh, quite the same. So you can regenerate or click on the next button. And now again, I have my paragraph here. Let's go on very quickly. So let me click on generate even on this paragraph and I will do the same thing with the other ones. I'm going really quickly just to show you how in a few clicks you can generate uh, an entire article or a draft for an entire article. Uh, you can then make your adjustments. You can uh, even add something else. Uh, you can even uh, change these uh, instructions here. Let me try in this one because uh, these are the uh, H2s that Jasper generated for you, but you can even uh, add something here. This is uh, something like a command, for example. So be less judgmental. We all have our own quirks and that's okay. If you want, you can, for example, add here some subtopics to talk about uh, in uh, this paragraph. So, for example, in this case, I'm not expert of this topic. I just took this as an example. So, I, if I want to generate some subtopics for this uh, topic, for this H2, I can copy it, uh, insert it here in my document, because as you can see, you can even work on this part of the document. So, I can just give a command to Jasper here. For example, uh, write uh, some uh, subtopics about uh, this uh, uh, topic. So, let me try this command by clicking run command. Here I have some subtopics. So, for example, I can uh, copy now these ones here as subtopics. And now I can try to generate this paragraph. I think uh, it will include even something of these uh, subtopics in this example. If you read this paragraph, you will see that uh, uh, quite all of these subtopics are included in a conversational way. So it's not uh, bad if you want, uh, when you edit your article, you can go deep in uh, these kind of uh, explanations. Anyway, I just click on next and now my paragraph is here and uh, we are now at the blog post conclusion paragraph. I just need to click on generate. If I want, I can even insert a call to action. I will not do it in this case. Generate and let's see how this conclusion is. Okay, this is my blog conclusion. Uh, let's write our H2 here. Uh, the only thing that uh, is missing here in my uh, article draft uh, is uh, 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 an introduction uh, because uh, this uh, blog post workflow doesn't include an introduction. Uh, but uh, again, in my opinion, this is to generate uh, an article draft uh, and not an entire article. So I can uh, insert my H1 here, for example, and give Jasper a command, uh, write a compelling introduction as I do in other cases. So I just click on the command. And now I have some kind of uh, quick introduction to this uh, article. Again, I can uh, expand uh, any uh, paragraph here uh, just by using commands, as always. Uh, this is my draft document. And as you can see, we are uh, near to a thousand words. I can, for example, in this one, uh, give Jasper a simple command like uh, expand on the paragraph 
above. This is one of the simple commands you can use to uh, add something to your uh, paragraph. Okay, and just by using this command, I now have a 1111 words. So again, uh, let's say I want to add uh, something here. For example, as you can see, we are talking here about uh, uh, don't be afraid to strike up a conversation with someone new. Uh, let's say something like uh, give me some example of uh, interesting conversations uh, to start with people. Let's see what Jasper suggest me. As you can see, I have some ideas here, how to start a conversation with a stranger, the art of small talk, what to talk about when you don't know what to say. Uh, quite interesting because, as you can see, you can have uh, some little ideas to add something interesting for your reader into your article. So I can just uh, make this an H3, for example, uh, go here with my cursor and just click Compose to go on with these uh, sub topics. And as you can see, I have some uh, ideas to expand on, uh, on this how to start a conversation with a stranger. Again, here, this can be another H3. As you can see, you start with your blog post workflow, and then you can uh, add anything you want in your article by using the classic Jasper AI way, so commands and compose buttons. I now have a 1,239 words. Obviously, it depends on your topic. Maybe it's something more technical. In the case, uh, maybe the blog post workflow is not the best way to uh, write an article. You may use recipes, you may use the classic way, but for uh, some kind of topics, uh, this is really a great help uh, and it's just another way uh, you can generate uh, quickly your articles or your draft inside Jasper AI. Again, I suppose they will let you uh, generate your own customized uh, workflows in the future. Now, very quickly, I just want to show you the other two uh, workflows you have here, social media campaign workflow. If you uh, use uh, social media, uh, this is uh, really interesting because you have a uh, quick way to generate uh, this kind of content. For example, here you have your global context, so you can insert your company name, your company information, and then you have uh, some steps. For example, engaging instant post. Uh, so here you can generate a really engaging post. Uh, you have an hashtag generator, you have a Twitter thread generator, you have a Facebook post headline, you have a Facebook post body, you have a LinkedIn post. Uh, so uh, by following uh, this uh, workflow, you can really quickly generate uh, your post uh, for different uh, social media platforms uh, at the same time. And then you have this uh, third one, it's the rewrite content workflow. This can be useful if you want to rewrite something, better if it's something you wrote yourself, don't steal other people's content, but you can summarize your content, you can generate an outline, even in this case, you can rewrite a content, you can add extra paragraphs to consider, and this is another uh, workflow you have inside Jasper AI. If you want to try this new feature, you can do it. Click on the link you find here below my video. You can try Jasper AI for free for five days using 10,000 words for free. And with 10,000 words, you can try uh, many of these uh, new features and many of the other templates or commands or every future Jasper AI has for you. This was just a quick video to show you how this new workflow feature works inside Jasper AI. Again, it's just another way to write content uh, other than templates, uh, the classic editor, recipes. Now you can do it 
even in this way if you find it useful. If you want to watch my previous videos about Jasper AI, you can find an entire playlist here on my channel with this kind of videos. Here is the link. If you found this video helpful, please click on the like button, subscribe to my channel, click on the bell and see you soon in another video here on Digital Toolcase.